uh, black men, black folks, don't let Joe Biden and, and the Democratic Party take your value for real, yo. The nation is changing right now. I don't know if you guys are noticing, we have a lot of different nationalities coming in from all over the world. They're going to school, they're buying businesses, they're owning homes, they speak two languages. And the only thing, not the only thing, but a, a lot in the newspaper, newspaper, newspaper is almost gone. But in the news, gun violence, young people, guns, what is the problem? This is the most prosperous time in the world. And car, carjack, what do you do with a car after you carjack it? Petty robbery, petty, a lot of murder, like couples, kids, murder, suicides. And we got to get a grip. We got to, we cannot, black folks, black men, surrender our value to Joe Biden and the Democratic Party. I'm not, you can. I'm not surrendering my value. Yes. Black folks benefited from slavery. I'm benefiting from slavery because I know my peoples came across that Atlantic Ocean and they didn't come on a Disney cruise or Norwegian or carnival with a buffet and a pool. They had to struggle across that Atlantic Ocean and a lot of them didn't make it. And when they got here, they worked hard and there wasn't any unions or any union strikes in them cotton fields and that sun. There wasn't any, they didn't have EV, EV cars. And so I know if my ancestors can survive that, then my potential is limitless. My ancestors didn't have uh, Snap Tube and Insta Twitter and Face Talk. So I have all these benefits in my hands and I got to represent for my ancestors. Do not surrender your value.